happy, baby, you're so beautiful. Uh -huh. Love me, love me, love me, love me. Kiss me, kiss me. Touch me, touch me, tease me, tease me. Love me, love me. Just promise me you will never let me go. And I promise you I'll do anything for you. Oh, no, 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 no. Love me, love me. Kiss me, kiss me. Tease me, tease me. Oh, no, 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 no. Love me, love me. Kiss me, kiss me. Touch me, touch me. Right, no, 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 no. Just promise me you will never let me go. I do anything for you. Right now, now, now. wanted to say thank you for today. I mean, I got your message at the filling station. <laughs> well, it might be nothing to you, but um, it was actually big, and I really appreciate it. Thank you. Well, I'm fine. I'm good, and you? Um, not, not really. 
he's crippled now. Well, he did. But I guess luck was against him. Um, I just called to say thank you. Just to let you know that I really appreciated what you did today. Okay, bye. Characterized like a pregnancy. See, the more you try to hide it, yeah, is the more it comes to light, yeah, one way or another. So be careful what you do, be careful how you treat another, be careful what you do. What are we going to do? Honestly, I don't know. Huh? What time is the lecture? 10 12 a.m. Um, do you know any mechanic around? It's a mechanic. Let me get my phone. Um, yeah, hello. No, I'm not too fine. I have a little issue. My car, um, my car broke down along the road and I have a 10 o'clock class. Yes. Along the uh, Mwabushi Road. Yes, that's where we're parked. Mm -hmm. Close to the former commissioner's house. Yes. All right, thank you. Okay, bye. Mechanic, right? No. Kelvin. Kelvin, Kelvin. Which Kelvin? How many Kelvin do you know? I don't understand. When did this start? When did what start? <laughs> You're talking comfortably with him, meaning that you guys have been talking for a long time. What do you mean, why? We just need help. I think we should sit and wait for him to come. Characterized like a pregnancy. See, the more you try to hide it, yeah, is the more it comes to light, yeah, one way or another. So be careful what you do. Be careful what you do together. Be careful what you do. I didn't have any mechanic to call. That's why I called you. We we have a ten o'clock class. I just needed a quick response. So hope you don't mind. Yep. I'm sorry for the inconvenience. Kelvin, good morning. Yeah, good morning. Okay. 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 Boruru. Yeah, bring one of the cars to number 26, Wanbushi Street. Yeah, beside the uh, commissioner's quarters. The yeah, commissioner's house. Alright, hurry up. I'm waiting. That's very kind of you. Thank you very much. Oh, you're welcome. Bring one of the cars. Uh, so what? Okay, let me call. Boss. You don't wanna uh, know the man. Oh yeah, come, 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 come. You don't wanna come, uh, But for your love, I've already paid the price. I don't even understand. What is it that makes you cry? See you are breaking my heart. Oh no. How many lies? How many times do you have to lie to me? Oh, oh. and how much pain in so many ways did you have to bring to me? Oh, oh. 
crying, I'm hurting my love. I'm hurting inside. I'm broken, I'm broken. Can you see me crying? I'm crying, I'm hurting deep inside. I'm hurting deep inside. Love, love, give me girl. I want to say a very big thank you. We're grateful. Thanks. You're welcome. Thank you. I, I, I wanted to ask, how much did the mechanic collect from you? Oh, uh, don't worry about that. Oh. Okay, and thanks again. <laughs> And what do we offer you, please? Uh, nothing, nothing. I'm fine. Really? Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. Uh, are you okay? Yeah, I'm um, perfect. Are you sure? Yes. I'm burning silently. Okay. I'm hurting, I'm hurting. Can you see me hurting? Clara, I have been calling you all morning. What is going on? I'm sorry, I was in class when you were calling. And after you got out of class, you saw my missed calls. Why did you not call me? Williams, did you just hear me? I said I am sorry, I was in class. What is it? Hello? Hello? You heard what I said, right? Yes. Clara, I can hear you. Um, I'm, I'm sorry, I would have to call you back. My mom is calling. Okay, alright, bye. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> Hello, damsel. And hi, the handsome guy. Wow, what a beautiful name. I swear to you, you're the first person to call me such a beautiful name. Oh, please shut up. You know that is a lie. From the pit of hell, actually. I'm not lying, I'm being truthful. <laughs> okay, let's take it that you are not lying. So, how are you? <laughs> well, I'm great, doing great, fine. Just that I'm missing someone. You're missing someone. A he or she? Uh, uh, she of course. So why don't I drop the call so you can talk to she? And hear her voice. Nah, 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 don't do that. Don't do that. I'm very comfortable with the voice I'm hearing right now. And you think you still want to miss that person? Ah. Uh, what do I tell you? <coughs> the person I'm missing is the voice I'm hearing. <laughs> You're crazy and you know it, right? <laughs> I'm not lying. Like I said, I'm being truthful. I'm telling you the truth. <laughs> okay, so what's for the day? Hmm? <laughs> all right, all right, all right. I don't even understand What is it that makes you cry? See you are breaking my heart Oh no Many lies, not many times. Do you have to lie to me? Oh, oh. and how much pain. 
Tell me you were coming. That is because I wanted to surprise you. So, um, how are you? <laughs> I have missed you. Okay. Now that you have me here, you can actually eat me a lot. <laughs> Clara, how was today's lecture? Oh, boring as usual. Please, what do you have in this house? I'm famished. I need ecosystem. Ah, oh, you are a lifesaver. <laughs> Thank you, darling. I need to eat something. Um, I'll be right back. Okay. <laughs> Woo. Okay, yeah, I'll just keep you company. I'll be back. I All need right. to eat something. Okay. Did you notice something? No. What's that? Never mind. everything is fine or why would you ask your attitude you've been cold towards me is everything okay williams i don't understand this i haven't been cold towards you why would you say so williams you call me williams um Sorry about that. I said I'm sorry. I called you so that you can come home. So we can start plans for what we agreed on. And the thoughts will be? Uh, sorry, please just remind me. I... Our marriage. So, um, when do you want me to come? Anytime now. I can't wait any longer. Okay, um, I'll, co I'll come this weekend. Yes, the weekend. Clara, I love you. You know that, right? Thank you. I'm broken, I'm broken. Can you see me crying? I'm crying. I'm hurting deep inside.
even go walk your room. Eh? You, you, you. Why are you kissing her? I say what? Why are you? Why are you kissing? Why are you kissing her? Eh? The boy, get it. What is it? Eh? You? Eh? Does your mother know that you've been kissing from junction to junction? Eh? So your mouth now is for everybody to be kissing. Eh? See, in fact, you're not those in a tea again. You will see the Eh? Baby, I'll see you later. Hi! And they cook for me. For me, bro. Wait, wait for me. Eh? Baby, be what you want. Eh? Idiot! Idiot! Come on! Come on! Come on! Eh? That man you are insulting is my fiance. Imagine, that man you are insulting is not only fiance, he's your Francis. And me, I'm your husband. How many people will you marry? Eh? How many people will you marry? You're confused. Eh? See, you, you are following him because of this small car. Eh? See, let me tell you, it's small thing that this guy is bigger than Vito. Eh? Rubbish. What's in your coins? Eh? You want to break my heart. This boy is a gold digger. Then, I, I know your house. I know your house. Then, then, Stop. Then, ah. See, eh? You take out. Eh? Today, I will kill you, Sokol. Sokol, what did you do that? Uh, mm. What else? You to say that. You need to say that. See, eh? He's a wise snatcher. Eh? Look, look at him now, he's laughing. He's a wise snatcher. Wise snatcher? Yes! Eh? Brother, mm -hmm. who is he talking about? Who else? He's not snatching now. Oh, we are. Eh? Oh, 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 Huh? Go, go home. I will talk to myself. Go, go. See, you take all eh? I will go. Uh -huh. But next time, oh, mm. next time, I see him close to my wife. Eh? Oh, you people should just prepare for his burial. Is your burial we're going to prepare listen, for? Listen, 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 so, you would uh, have to Yes, in fact, allow me to keep on the police. No, no. Don't worry. Don't worry. Let me, let me see you. Let me see you again. Nonsense. Nonsense. You're laughing. 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 So, what is it you said you wanted to ask me? Hmm. All right. Oh, uh, so tell me about him. What really happened? Well, he... he... He bought a house for my mother, myself and my sister. On that fateful day, he had... Um, <coughs> he had taken us from the old house to the new house. And on his way back, he, he had an accident. But you know what I don't understand is why everyone keeps blaming me, accusing me of causing his accident. I mean, it was meant to happen. But then I wouldn't even have my peace. Everybody thinks that accident happened because of me. What am I supposed to do? Okay, let's be frank here. I just want you to be the judge. Have I done anything wrong? I mean, I've been with this man for eight months, taking him from one place to the other. I have tried. I am too young to go through that kind of stress. But nobody seems to understand. Does, does it feel like I've done something wrong? Because no, 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 you've done nothing wrong. At the same Jesus. time, of we are human. I understand. I feel for him. Huh? But oh, it's all right. It's all right. So. Uh, well, I, I, I felt for him at the initial stage, but then I have a life. I'm still a very young girl. It's my happiness and not theirs. Yeah. I can't be going through that kind of stress at this young age. So I, basically, that's what happened. I mean, I used to feel bad, but not anymore. I understand. Life is all about happiness. Hmm? Uh, 
It's just so beautiful that you understand me. Oh. I mean, no one else has ever said these words to me. I do. I do. I understand everything perfectly. Oh, yep. Well, I'm not going to have an accident. Shut so up. I wasn't talking about you having an accident. What's wrong with you? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> what happened? Clara. Why did you not come back home last weekend as we agreed? I, I waited for you. Yes, I was supposed to come. But I thought you understood it already. I said I'm busy. My second semester exam is coming up. So what are you saying? What I'm saying is that I need you to give me time. Uh, maybe after my graduation. Clara. Your graduation is in two years time if I'm not mistaken. Yes. Um, I will be glad if you could do this for me. Clara, why are you turning me down? What are you saying, Williams? I don't understand it. But what do you mean turning you down? Why are you take why are you trying to take this in a different dimension? You know what? I I'll call you back. I I need to fix something. to see you as I have some complaints about Clara. Not only has she changed, Clara lately has been avoiding me. Please don't say that again, my prince. It is the truth. 
We agreed that she would come home so that we can make plans for the wedding. She did not come home. She did not call. I got worried. So I started calling. I called Clara severally and she did not take my calls. She did not return my calls either. But then I kept calling. And when she eventually picked up, we talked. And she told me that she thinks that we're going too fast. That she would appreciate it if I give her some time. So in the interest of peace, I asked her how much time she would want. Clara told me that she would be ready after graduation. Mama, you and I know that after graduation will be two years from now. I brought me five hours. That was not the agreement. You mean my daughter Clara told you this? That is why I'm here. Hoping that if you have a heart to heart talk with her as her mother, she would maybe listen to you or open up and tell you the truth. Tell you why she has suddenly changed, why she's avoiding me, why she's hurting me. Um, my prince, please. Don't worry yourself. Mm. Go ahead with whatever plan you have with her. Definitely she will come back. That I promise you. She will come back. Trust me. I shall take your word for it. I don't see promise around. How is she doing? Um, she's not yet back from school. It is fine. Let her know that I was here. And sure. send my warm regards to her. I will. Huh? Thank you very much for your time. Guards. My, my prince. prince. You sounding this way? You're scaring me. What is it? Stop asking me questions. Do as I say. Oh, Demi. Mama, listen. You need. No sense. Hello. Is there any problem? It's my mom. I I need to get to my village right now. Oh. Is she sick? No, she's not, but I mean, she sounded really worried. I need to go. Oh, uh, all right. You want me to go with you? It's okay. I'll see you when I get back. But I need to leave right away. Okay? Um, I'll see you when I get back. Let me just pick up my bag and then just hold on. What was your arrangement with Prince Williams? I had no arrangement with him, Mama. He talked about getting married to me and I told him to wait, maybe after graduation. Really? Did you just open down your mouth and told him that? Yes, I did. After all, I'm the one getting married to him. I know when I'll be happy or not. So please, Mama, let's not just push this. Be cool. <laughs> now I get it. 
Listen to me, Clara. I am a woman. Your mother precisely. If there's anything outside your relationship with Prince Williams, consider it a waste. Because it will not work. I will never stay alive to see you just that young man. Never. Hey, sister, shut up. Mr. Mama, seriously, I don't know what you're talking about. I don't understand this whole thing. I don't want you to understand. The only thing I want you to understand is stand up from here right now. Go to his house because already I told him you are coming today. Mama, I can't go to his house. I'm going back to school. Then, if you want to be an orphan, then let me play that thing I told you on phone. Let me show you an example of what I told you on phone. Right now, under your own very nose. Mama Chiri, go do I, I, Are you threatening me? It's not a threat. But I'm only telling you what I'm about doing under your own nose now if you don't stand up to go and see Prince Williams in his house. Sister, don't do it. I said shut up. And you shut up. Characterized like a pregnancy. See, the more you try to hide it, yeah, is the more it comes to light. Yeah, one way or another. So be careful what you do. Be careful how you treat another. Be careful what you do. Be careful how you treat another. What did you tell me? Oh, please shut up and don't call me that nonsense. What exactly did you tell my mother? to my mother will actually change my mind. Baby, please. Calm down, okay? Whatever it is, we can talk about it. We can, we can, we can sort it out. Just tell me what it is. Please, I beg you. Now you want to talk. You're asking me to calm down. Williams, what is your problem? It was just one thing, one simple thing I asked of you. Time. After my graduation, we could do anything you want. Go on with your plans, but no. All you could do is run to my mother and report me. I didn't report you, baby. I didn't report you. I just told her how you've been treating me. In the hopes that you would confide in her as your mother. And that way, I get to know what is happening to us. I did not report you. Well, since she wants to wait. You could go out there, get another woman, and marry her. Because you see this girl standing right here is not ready for marriage. And let me make this clear. The next time you go to my mother and spit nonsense, you won't like my reaction. How many lies? How many times? Do you have to lie to me? Oh, oh. And how much pain in so many ways did you have to bring to me? Oh, oh, oh. I'm broken, I'm broken. Can you see me crying? I'm hurting my love. I'm hurting inside I'm broken, I'm broken Can you see me crying? I'm crying I'm hurting deep inside I'm hurting deep inside Love, love Getting up Come on, 
Where's your car? I returned it. Did he request for it? He did not. I was just tired. And I don't want any more insults from him. Imagine the fool. He had the guts to report me to my mother, saying that I have been avoiding him. Can you imagine serious? that? Yes. <sighs> Let's see. <clears throat> oh, you see. Any first marriage doesn't last. You know these exact words she just said? It's the same thing I need my mother to hear. I mean, the woman is not even listening to me. She doesn't even care about my own feelings. But she should understand you're an adult. You have every right to make your own decision. Mm. Huh? You see, right now, I don't care. I am done being a maid to that guy. I have tried. For the past eight months, I have been taking this man back and forth. Can you imagine? He even defecates on his bed. Wow. I have to do the cleaning, do everything. I mean, they should, they should understand where I am coming from. I am tired. And then his useless sister, Daisy, wouldn't even for once come into the room to help her own brother. All she does is send a maid to clean her brother up. So a full-grown man. For eight years, you've been a slave in that house. For eight months. For I, eight months. Yes, eight months. It's been hell. Hell. Let's just take me out of here. I need to go somewhere and relax at times. Not a choice we make. I'm solely up to us. We find your better blue. We're going to tell a cut. Your daughter is there in me. I'm just keeping quiet because of you. If not. I would have taught her a lesson she would never forget in a hurry. No, no, Pico. My knees are on the ground. Please, I'll make sure I call her to order. Please. Do that as soon as possible. I will. You may sit. Thank you. Janet. Your Majesty. If I ever see my son in, in pains again because of her, I will put her in a condition she will never come out of. Your Majesty, please calm down. Hold every of your action for now. Please. You know my husband, the king. He's a no-nonsense man. I know. Good. All these things are like this because he's not aware of anything yet. Um, Lolo, please, don't tell him yet. I will make sure I bring her first thing tomorrow morning. Please. It's a promise. Please. I'll be waiting. Thank you. Either you follow me personally to the village or you kill me here today. It is better you bury me in this house, Mama, because I will not move an inch. What is it? I have, I have papers and you will yes, bring me. Follow me to the village. I am not going like Clara, let's go. Mama, please, please, Mama, down. follow me to the village now. Mama, stop this. Home. It is better you go with me peacefully or you kill me here. Then get a cutlass because you will cut off my head. I am not leaving this compound. What is it now? Alright. Eh? What is it? Will you keep quiet? Keep quiet! You knew about it all this while. But you kept you it to yourself. You didn't even bother to tell me. And I didn't tell you it's alright. Eh? Follow me to the village. Mama, I have to call my car. I have to call my car. Leave me alone. Mama, Mama stop. Hey, Mama, Clara, Mama, calm it down now. Case, case. Just, just respect yourself. Sorry? Uh, Rest come, come on. What's going on? Mama, please. What's that? Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Go, go. Who? Who are you? Who? Who? Mama, who? Who are you? Mama. Mama. Eh? Yeah, um, yeah, sorry. So, yes. Uh, my name is Kelvin. Uh -huh. uh, I'm her fiance. Is it? Yeah! Is it Mama Biko? Yeah, what? Madam, please, please take it easy. Talk what is it? Uh, yeah, we, 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 we can talk this way. Talk what over? Talk what over that you confused my daughter. Took her away from the man that suffered for her. The man that gave me shelter. The man that gave her the, this whole building. The man that, will, that even went. Oh, the man that cannot even walk. Still because of her. And you are telling me that we can stay here to talk this over. Tell me what you want to talk over. 
The only talk about is for her to follow me to the village. Mama. That's all it is. Mama. Hey! Mama, 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 keep quiet! Keep quiet! I'm talking like this. You keep quiet! I'm talking like talking. Mama. Keep quiet! Mama. 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 I don't, it's either you kill me here or you follow me to the village. Mama, I'm going to go to the village. Mama, please, listen to what I have to say. When I met your daughter, she wasn't walking along with any man. And since I met her, no man has ever walked up to me to tell me she belongs to him. Please, I'm saying this not because I'm involved, but because I know it's the truth. Please, this action you're about to take, I want you to have a rethink. It is an adage that says, you can force a horse to the stream, but you cannot force that horse to drink water. Mama, please, do not take this action you're about to take and make your daughter regret all the days of her life. Marriage is supposed to be something you enjoy all your life, not regret. It's supposed to be eternal. Please, at your own quiet time, think about all I have said. Kevin! Mama! 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 Stupid! I'm talking about Kevin. Dude! Shut up! I hope you know he cannot assume the truth because of his condition. How did you know that? Because I'm a Libo man and I know much about the tradition. I am very close to tradition. He has told me that before. Fine. Now tell me, what is the need of getting married to someone that will be a liability to you for the rest days of your life? Listen, he has. He lost it. He lost everything. He lost everything because of me. Lie. He lied to you. Probably that's what he made you believe. But listen, right from the very first day he was born, it has been written that he's going to get that accident with you or without you. So come on, stop blaming yourself. He has done a lot for me. Come on. I mean, I Hey, possibly come, leave him now. Come on, I thought you were more exposed. Now, Phil, let's bring it up. This, for example, is the opposite side. It is you, the accident placed on the wheelchair. Do you think he'll be so proud of you? Telling people, yes, he had an accident, he's in this condition because of me? No. Probably he would have gotten married to one other girl from the village, probably your friend and make her the queen of Uma is a kingdom. Come on. Think about what I just said. Think about it. Think about it. Come on, I thought you were more exposed. Now, now, wait, wait. Let's, 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 let
is the opposite side. side. It is you, you that has a place to have no change. Do you think he's so proud of you? Tell him to yes, he had an answer in this condition because of me? No. Probably would have gotten married to one or the girl of a family, probably your friend. And make her the queen of women's kingdom. Come on. Listen, Listen to me, Clara. Clara. I, I, I am a woman. woman. Your, Your mother, mother precisely. If, if there's, there's anything, anything outside, outside your relationship, relationship to Prince Williams, Williams mm -hmm. consider, consider it a waste. waste. Because, because you know what? I would, I would never, never stay alive, alive to see you just like that young man. man. Never. never. Janet. Your Majesty. Where is your daughter? I went to the city. I tried all I could, but she refused to follow me. Shut up, you liar! I'm not lying. How dare you lie before my mother? Aren't you afraid? Or you want me to order the guards to beat you up? Oh, what is this stuff? No, mother! Why would she lie before us? I'm not lying. Are we kids? You know what, Mom? Allow me to handle this matter myself. Uh, His Majesty, I swear by the gods of Ibenda community, I tried all I could to bring her back, but all to no avail. Please, I'm not lying. Your daughter cannot eat her cake and expect to have it back. Get out of my compound. <laughs> Please. Don't touch me. Please. Don't touch her. Please. God! Uh, please, please. She said you should get out. God! Please. Run if you can. can have it, right? And what is that supposed to mean, Princess Daisy? Is it by force to marry your brother? Oh, now you know marriage is not by force. God, bundle her into the car. What? Now if you dare lay your filthy hands on me, I will give you the pity don't touch me! 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 Don't touch me!
you to ever point at me again. Never. Um, Williams, it's okay. All right? A Daisy. Who asked you to bring her here? Nobody, father. I did it on my own. Because that girl is a gold digger. She can't eat a cake and have it. Uh, uh, Mama, tell this girl to stop running. Mark, you I will break your neck. Did I ask you to help me collect my cake? Are you mad? Are you out of your mind? Now, listen up, everyone. A Daisy. Father. Anytime you take orders from any other person in this palace without my consent, then I will show you an example of how to be honest and obedient. Is that okay? No. God! God! Go untie that girl and set her free. Mm -hmm. 